everybody welcome back to my channel happy friday love the weekend i want to start this video by saying thank you to my friend oh. i met her online crazy concept to think about i feel like guys always meet friends online through gaming but because of the social media influencer world i have made a friend and she is so sweet to have sent me two products like what i've actually never used road products so these are my first two ever she mailed them to me we have been trying to figure out a time to meet up and you know get to know each other she travels a lot for work from what i can tell so she's just like basically always 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 out i will put her user her name's teresa so thank you so much teresa i actually don't know how she found me i don't know if she found me through youtube but if she ever watches this video thank you teresa i finally get to try the glazing milk i think everyone and their mothers talked about for so so freaking long and this is actually my first milky toner i love the packaging it's just so sleek kind of reminds me of like dermalogica road peptide lip treatment i have to sneeze <laughs> The packaging's just so cute because it just like matches perfectly. I did try this on already and it's so shiny on the lips. I get some of like the little gritty bits, but it doesn't really bother me. I already like this a lot. I already want other colors. Aiden is not home today. He is actually having a recharge day. Essentially, it's just extra days off. So he's actually at a golf tournament with some of his hockey friends. And then he actually has a stag that he's going to later tonight. And then I'm here. I do actually have an appointment very, very, very soon for acupuncture. I haven't gone to acupuncture in like over two months, I wanna say. It's covered by my insurance, so that's kind of nice. As much as people wanna say it's like a pseudoscience, I could see that. It could be a placebo effect. I don't really care because I do feel better after it. Once I'm done that, I'm gonna come home and shower and have dinner, and then I have to get ready to go out. I am getting drinks with some girlies. Also, if you're wondering why it's like almost summer and I'm wearing a knit sweater, I get cold really, really easily when I have exposed skin, so I basically have to be wearing like pants and a sweater if there's any air conditioning on. Thank you guys so much for watching another video. I hope you guys enjoy. I honestly wasn't sure if I was in a vlog. Okay, well, I'm gonna change it out of the sweater because it's hot as balls outside. If you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I post every single Friday and I primarily do vlogs. So I am back now. I'm rushing because that was way longer of a session than I'm used to. Some gross looking split pea soup, which you guys can't really see, but this is the color. Half of a bagel, just as a little more substance. Wanna see my back though? I'll talk to you guys once I am done eating because I need to like pile this food into my body. Hello, hello. I couldn't decide if I wanted to shower or not because he puts like oil on my back. Look how rosy my cheeks are because I'm in a rush. Guess what I want to use? We're gonna use this as my moisturizer. It's thick. I was literally laying on that table for so long at my appointment that I have lines on my forehead. That feels nice. And then I'm gonna go in with my Toradin moisturizer. Ugh, I hate this. I feel like every single time I go out now, I'm always in a rush. Like I don't get to fully, fully enjoy this experience, which ugh, is such a shame because I think I've mentioned before, I love getting ready. God damn, my skin is red. Try to do my makeup relatively quickly and then I will talk to you guys once I'm done. I will also let you guys know what outfit I go with because I actually have no clue what outfit I wanna wear yet. I will BRB. Hello. I'm basically ready. Sorry for flooding is terrible, but I am wearing this cute little like midi skirt and this gray tank top And I'm just gonna wear this pink bag that is backwards right now. That's my look. I am running late. So let's go I'm gonna take you guys on my phone Good morning. It's actually in the morning still. It's 11.47. I am hungover. I did not record a lot last night because I low-key forgot because I was drunk. <laughs> Anyways, last night was really fun. Got to see a bunch of my friends. First, we went to Paradise Grotto, which we got like really cute drinks, but we only stayed for one. And then we ended up trying to get into two cats, couldn't get in, so we went to locals only. And then we also went upstairs to Laissez Faire. Now, where we go afterwards? I don't really know. My friend James and his friends went somewhere else. My friend Lauren and I went and met up with them. I did spend quite a bit of money. You know, like when you tap your phone for everything and then you get notifications from your bank. So I see is like $50, $30, $60, and I'm like, why did I do that? I really want to go to the little market by Ossington. Well, actually, I need to shower and get ready because Aiden's grandparents are doing their oh. 70th anniversary and they like to celebrate with their friends and family. We're going to Markham. That starts at 3 and we're probably going to go for dinner around like 5, 5.30 and then we'll be back home. I don't know why I just looked lit. Oh, I also got a, a nasty little hot dog. Let's get ready. I'm going to put this away. Actually, I'm going to have one more sip. Why the fuck did that just spray everywhere? Do you see that? I actually like to have to 
stop doing this because I feel so sick the next day. Very unwell. It is what it is. I'm gonna put on very light makeup because we do have to like leave ASAP. The number of burps I've been having. I'm like scared of myself right now. It smells like white pepper. Let me finish getting ready. Bye guys. Hello. I'm dressed now and I look somewhat presentable. I also don't feel as terrible now. I just really want a crisp Coke Zero right now. Okay, let's talk to the car. This is what I'm wearing. Cute little skirt. I'm finally back home. Still a little hungover. My stomach hurts. My head luckily is fine now. It was really nice seeing everyone, catching up. Ian's grandparents are so cute. Honestly, like I feel bad because I haven't really vlogged yesterday or today because I honestly don't think that Eden and I are gonna do anything worthy of vlogging tonight. I'm going to wash my face because I feel like greasy and just gross from wearing makeup and not feeling well. And then I want to lay down and rot for a little bit. I have some work to do, so I'll just do that in bed. But tomorrow we are going to go to that market that I wanted to go to. was way too hungover to go to today. Update. Look what we got. We got some snackies. <gasps> then we also got these, which I'm going to eat. Good morning. I have two beverages here. I'm awake a little earlier than usual. Aiden and I actually went to bed earlier than usual, which is good. I am really trying to fix my sleep schedule right now. I usually sleep at like 2 a.m. and then I wake up at like 9.30. <laughs> Ew. Sorry, I just noticed like our flowers died and there's like mold on them. I'm gonna throw this out right now. So I'm trying to sleep earlier and get up earlier. And I think to hold myself accountable, I might do like a mini TikTok series. I actually will have no motivation. And I think similarly to YouTube, you guys motivate me a lot to go out and do things. I could actually just like lay in my house and rot for hours and hours and days and days and not see anyone or do anything. And I think filming it and posting it holds me accountable too. Hopefully I can stick to it. I woke up at like nine and the reason I woke up at nine was because I got ready a little bit. We are going to the market. I have my little notebook, pen. Look at this cute little pen my friend got me for my birthday. Unassuming pen. So cheap feeling, but it's like one of the best to write with. I hate when like pens are ultra smooth and they just glide. And then I have my laptop because I have to brainstorm for a brand. Let's get started because I need to throw out these gross moldy flowers. They're kind of scaring me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I'm done doing my brainstorming session, but I did change and it's like 18 degrees. So I feel like I can wear this. I've been wanting overalls for so long and I got these a while ago, but I haven't been able to wear them. I also thrifted this little bralette top. I have not shoes yet. These are a little bit big for me. I think she's cute. Leaving now. I've decided that I'm gonna go back out to get my nails removed because they are really like old and gross. So I love these nails and I do think this is a really fun color. I think I'm gonna do like a pretty jelly pink and I'm gonna do almond this time. Almond just makes your fingers look more slender. I did really like that jewelry stand that I showed you guys, but I didn't end up getting anything. This is what I really wanted when I went to the market, replica perfume oils that smell exactly like their more expensive counterparts. It was three for $50. One of them I am giving to my coworker. I actually have this one in my collection. It's a dupe for dip Teaks Philosikos, Philosikos. I love these because they last so long on the skin. And the two that I got were Sophia and Memories of Matcha. It's like sweet, but citrusy. I don't know which one I got. 
Um, okay, so Sophia is Killian's princess. You know what it smells like? If you really like Lush's, what's a leave-in conditioner called? Oh, Super Milk, that's what it's called. And then the second one that I got is Memories of Matcha. So also green tea scent. This one is definitely a lot more tea forward. It was unfortunate though, because there's like a couple that I really, really wanted. And then I went to go smell them. They just like did not smell good to me. And I think this is why I would never blind buy because it's just so hard to know if you'll actually like them. I'm gonna put this one for my friend in the bag. I don't wear this. I like putting it on my chest too, if that's not weird. This is what my hair looked like the entire time I was doing my nails, but they're done. Look how cute they are. They're super jelly and light pink. I really like them. And I did do the almond shape that I wanted. I haven't painted my nails in so long though. So I was so shaky and rough with my left hand. I was a little disappointed in myself. I love a simple clean girl moment. It took me like two hours or an hour and a half still to do all of that. I am like getting a cystic pimple here. I'm about to get my period. I'm gonna lay down for a little bit because I just need like a 30 minute break where I don't think and I can just rot. I finally got up. This is what we have at the moment. I took it out of the freezer and I really need to eat it and I don't wanna waste it. And then I have a shit ton of that split pea soup left. So we are gonna microwave some of that. But we have no clean bowls, which we actually need to buy more bowls because we frequently run out. I haven't done a lot at all. Literally just been laying in bed. I do wanna go to the gym in a little bit and I do have to wash my hair tonight because if I'm filming tomorrow, I wanna make sure that I look presentable. I feel like I got some sun. Ugh, I haven't gone to the gym in so long. I feel like I haven't felt like going to the gym ever. I don't know why. I have no motivation. I feel like crap. I'm tired all the time. I just want a break. I haven't taken a vacation from work actually in so, so freaking long. I am going to book off a day later in this month because my elementary school friend is getting married soon. So she is having her bachelorette. And one other girl that I went to elementary school with that we are all like super, super close. We're all going. That's really fun and really exciting. A luxury to have a friendship where you both are busy, have your own lives, but you still care for one another and you still think of one another. I can't believe that she's getting married. Where once summer hits and the sun starts to shine, everyone and their mothers gets engaged. I did a messy bun, but I feel like it kind of looks cute because there's like little things sticking out. For the remainder of the evening, I'm just going to edit. I'll probably edit a little bit after dinner so I can digest. I might do legs, but with like lighter weights so that I don't have to like cry. But the thing is like every single time I do legs, I think I need to like lift super, super heavy. And I got really sore at one point because I wasn't going consistently. And then that was a problem because then I wouldn't be able to walk for like a week straight. And then that made me not want to go and that's a problem also there's a gym opening near us and it used to be my old gym i used to go to anytime fitness in markham and now there's going to be one near me so i might hit up my friends who work at the markham location and see if they can get me like a discounted rate oh my god there's a balloon that's crazy mm -hmm. 